Welcome back, everyone, to the amazing world of Emacs. I've now made this video, I think, three different times um, in three different ways of uh, trying to get across what I want to show you here. And um, I think this is it. So I, I call this um, my rolling logbook uh, system, um, or I sometimes call it the captain's log because it kind of reminds me of the, the, the log from Star Trek uh, when Captain Kirk, you know, opens up his log and puts in the star date. Um, but basically, I've gone through a few times, like showing how this system is made, but you can actually watch some of my previous videos or, or other videos online. Because um, it's, it's basically like my one video on setting up a journal in org mode, it's the same thing, using the capture system, creating capture templates, and uh, creating a, a sort of running notebook. Uh, so let me kind of show you what it does uh, basically uh, so as i mentioned like this is a this is a log keeping system so let's say you have meetings or you have uh, various projects or things that you're doing where you want to keep a log of things and then um, at any moment go back and check um, for a specific kind of log entry using the tag system that org mode gives you that's basically all it is it's is so it's very simple it's very rudimentary and um, and it just works and it works been working really well for me at work and um, i've started using it um, like for to-do lists and certain things at home as well and it uh, it holds up pretty well so basically so let me show you now let's say um i've been having meetings with uh with like one of my co-workers like joe or someone i can quickly open up the org mode agenda hit m to you know to file or search by tag and you can be prompted for various tags in you know files that are in your in your agenda system and so i can pull up any entry that has joe tagged on it so you see um, these are the different entries they're they're dated with the time as well so you can have multiple entries in one day and uh, this was a, a to-do item uh that was related to uh to joe um so you can you can basically jump to any of these uh that was the to-do item right there and uh, Bert, hey, my dog's eating some paper. Um, and you can also, so let's say I've been having, um, in addition to regular meetings, I've been having brainstorming meetings with Joe. So if I want to look at just those entries, you can do Control C A, open the agenda, do a tag search for Joe plus brainstorm. And so any entries that involve Joe in a brainstorm uh, show up as well. This is all, you know, pretty basic stuff. Um, but also, so let's say in, um, in this meeting, you know, uh, me and Joe talked about a, a spreadsheet or something, um, or if I, let's actually, let's go to one of the brainstorming entries using the attachment system, which I made a video about recently, control C, control A, uh, I can create a, you know, a new file that is attached to this entry. And, you know, you can just write in it, do whatever you want. And, um, you know, it's all going to be saved in the, the data directory. It automatically creates a directory with um, using these, these hashes. And you can always go back and see that. So any, any files that you create related to this one note will always be saved in their own discrete directory there. Uh, so, so that's how you can integrate the attachment system. That's what I forgot to mention the last time I recorded this video. Um, so, uh, yeah, basically, and it also has a, a daily review. So as you, you're taking notes all day, you're, you're working, things are coming at you. Um, and then at the end of the day, you need to bring everything together and make sure you you've attended to the, the last things you need to do every day so that, you know, you can relax, you can go home, you can uh, play your video games or do whatever you like to do without having to think about work or any of the, the things related to this. So I just make a, a capture template for that as well. And uh, so that's on the D key right here. So now um, I usually tag the process, um, capture it. And um, here it is. So you have a space to put in any notes that are relevant and you can just go through that. I empty my inbox, that I check my calendar, uh whatever and then uh so yeah water the desk plant yeah i did it and now let's say your boss says oh you know i would also like you to check joe's calendar you know anything it doesn't really matter what it is i go right into my template open up the the daily review template uh 
check Joe's calendar. So, so now that's done. All you have to do is save that template. And then theoretically, the next day, control C, C, letter D for daily review process, capture it now. And every day, hence, you will have the, the to do to, to check Joe's calendar as well. So that's why I call it a rolling logbook because it just keeps rolling with you uh, day by day. Uh, anything you need to do, anything you need to check, um, and if if you want a if you want to do a weekly review or a monthly review, um, all you need to do is just create another template, and it keeps rolling in the in the system. And um, and that's about it. And to see how to create those templates, I have the video on uh, keeping uh, a journal in in Emacs. Um, so yeah, and all this stuff, as as I mentioned, this is all like basic. Uh, the, some of the, the base features of org mode, which which come with Emacs, you, I don't even think you have to install anything additional to to use this basic functionality. Um, uh, what I like about it is if you look at the the capture templates for the for the log and the daily review, they're basically the same. Each entry starts with an expansion here. This capital T converts into a timestamp with the date and the time. So you can have multiple entries throughout the day that um, can have the timestamp. This one, the percent and the G with the little carrot up carrot here, that um, prompts you for a tag, which you saw me do. And then this one just drops your point right down there so you can start writing in it. So as I said, this is very fast. You know, um, any interaction you have with someone um, you know, somebody came into your office, talked to you about something, control C, C, J, you know, whatever key you want to use. Uh, Bob dropped in um, office, you know, Bob dropped in out next week. All right, you can keep an Elon Musk style note. Fire everyone who sucks. Anything you want, it, it, it and you see, you can just quickly you just capture another entry, and um, as 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 I mentioned, like this is all really good at just emptying some of the mental shelf space, so you don't have to keep all this stuff in your head. You can basically get everything out, and um, if somebody asks, you know, uh, you know, did you chat with Bob about what? You know, look up Bob entries, and here's every you know, every conversation. Or interaction you've had with Bob recently, and um, yeah, I, I believe that is it. So Control U and R, you can search again. Uh, so you can kind of actually update these on the fly. That's interesting. So Control U R, you can do Joe. Let's switch them up. Yeah, so right from the agenda view here. So yeah, very cool stuff. That is the. Um, that's my rolling logbook system, my, my captain's log. If you have any questions or if there's anything I left out, uh, feel free to uh, drop a comment and uh, like, subscribe, and ring the bell and uh, do all of uh, all that stuff. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.